Okay, bestie, we're back at it. It's my favourite video of the month. So I've been cash stuffing all month. That is my sinking funds, that is my savings challenges. Every little bit of cash today is gonna to get consolidated. So these binders here can hold quite a lot of cash. And trust me, my money is safe. Don't you dare try and rob me. I know that's what you were thinking, bestie. But they can hold quite a lot of money. And I feel uncomfortable when a single envelope goes over £100. So when it does, I like to take all of that money, put a placeholder in. They look a little bit like this. Oh, and by the way, placeholders, bestie. New ones are coming very, very soon. They may even be in the shop right now. I'm filming this video a little bit early. If they are here already, I'll link them in the description because they're going to look very, very different. And bestie, they're stunning. I'm really pleased with them. Anyway, when there's over £100, what I do is I put a placeholder in. But I also take like the fibres and try to make them into the biggest notes I possibly can just so they don't get really really bulky. We're also here today with this cash tray. She's an absolute stunner and I have this in like so many colours on my Etsy store. So we need to get started bestie and I think we're going to start with this binder. So in here, there's only really two that I need to take a look at. So first of all, we've got water. And you know what? This water needs to come out because this whole envelope is going. Because since I've moved into my brother's, right, uh, I just need to pay the final water bill. And you know what? I probably, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing and I think it is because I've just realised after having moved in a month I haven't actually told the water company that I've moved out so oops. Okay moving on to car maintenance there seems to be a lot of fibres in here so we are at what are we at we've got a £100 placeholder already and we've got 20 40 60 75 and this is as small as it can be right now unless so I swap these 20 with this two tens over here so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna swap two of these fives for a 10 and that makes a much tidier and neater 75 so yeah uh, next month I'll put in 25 again and it'll be 200 so in next month's consolidation we'll be looking a lot better okay the rest here is nothing so let's move over to the next binder look we are motoring through bestie Let's have a look at this. So this is the Do Not Trust Eye Reminder. And da, 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 da. last month we completed the Onyx Challenge. You wouldn't have seen that because I did it live with my patrons. Uh, Bestie, she was brutal. So this uh, whole thing is coming out. Again, we're taking envelopes out left, right and centre. So let's take out this Onyx Challenge because Bestie, she's done. And this whole envelope here. So let's take out everything in there. We've got placeholders, which is 350. So we should have 150 coming out. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 50, 150. So that's going towards Simon and Gracie in case there is an emergency with them. And if you remember from last Sunday's video, we did the, my sort of, net worth or whatever it was what did i call it i don't know what i called it but in that video i told you it's in premium bonds so when i get another thousand pounds i'm just going to move it over okay australia has no notes in so looking good there neva does tattoo month ahead where are we at with that so month ahead has 100 200 placeholder 300 placeholder then 20 40 60 75 so that's the best it can be not bad at all. I think this is going to be one of those uh, videos where I can't really take very much money out. Oh, and clothing. She definitely does need to come out because we did the 100 and then we did the 20, 30, 40, 50. So 150. So I can go ahead and buy my trainers now. So I'm really excited about that. Solo. Where are we at with that? Um, we have got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. So let's go and swap that for 10, 20, 60. That was great adding up, Ira, well done. So 60 pounds in solo already, and we haven't even got the reverse card. So, oh geez, so that's gonna be good. Merry Cashmas, where are we at with that? I think we're at 160. Uh, where's the placeholder? Here she is. So 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. Oh, that's good. I'm gonna take this 60 and get that there. Oh, not very much. Try I don't think we're putting too much back into the bank, you know? So Merry Cashmas is done. And that's it for this binder. So 
very, very quickly, we are moving on to my favorite. Here she is, here's Big Bertha. So let's go take a look at her because she is bound to have not only a ton of coins, but loads of fives and loads of stuff to sort of do. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. So let's take this 40 and get, okay, well, that's all the 20s gone now. So 160, we are absolutely motoring through this. So save 250 now. Let's go in here, uh, 20, uh, no, so that's 45. So I really could do with a 20. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll come back to this one. Let's go to the back because I know I've completed this. Have I? This one. So this is the 2K one. So she's completed. So this is 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 50. So 150. So I'm gonna take that out and I'm gonna swap these placeholders. So I know I've got a 2000 placeholder because I've run out of fully funded. So if I put a 2000 in there, then I know, oh look, it's the perfect color as well. So she's done and she's done, perfect. Let's go back to this one. And what was it again? We need to count it again. So it's 20, 45. So no, that, that, 45, perfect. 45 in there, just makes it nice and tidy. Right, save 100, what's in here? So 100 pound in placeholder, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85. So 5, 10, 20, 40, 40. <laughs> My maths today. I can't even count. So that's 85 there, in as small as I can get it. And I've got a two pound coin as well. Absolutely wonderful, love it. And then 400 here. Um, 20, 30, 45, let's swap those two tens for a 20 and to tidy her up. Lovely, 45, there. And then say 500, feels like a lot, but probably not knowing me. So we've already got two placeholders, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90. Wonderful. <laughs> We're taking no money out of any of these. Wow. Okay. And then finally the save 1K. I have no hopes for her, I really don't. So we've got uh, 350 in placeholders. 20, 40, 60, 80, one. Okay, 20, 40, 60, 80, two, 10, 20, 30. So if I take that, that's 30. And then this is 200 here. So five, 10, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82. 100, two, 300, 550 plus 30. That's how much we've got. So yeah, good. Right, that is all the money that, oh look, there was placeholders here too. Right, that's all the money out. And you know what, Big Bertha, oh, she feels so much better. Like, look at that. That's so much better. Okay, so money aside, here she is here. We do need to bring out the calculator because we need to work out how much we've got left. So how much we've got here, what we're putting back to the bank. So uh, water was 25, Simon and Gracie was 150, uh, clothing was 50, and four and a half K we took 350 out. So we're taking out 575. So let's count that up now. So 20s was, Two, four, six, eight, one, two, four, six, eight, two, two. So 220. And then, oh, there's a lot of tens actually. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. So 290. Okay, so this should be 65 according to my calculations. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65. 65. Cool, 575. Wow. I mean, this was a very, very small cash consolidation, but do you know what? 
that's 575 going back into my account. It's going to gain interest. I'm going to have money for my water bill, which I should have paid like a month ago. Simon and Gracie are now covered because we finished that. Clothing, I can now buy like my shoes that I wanted. And I'm closer with my home as well. So while this is like probably the smallest cash contemplation we've ever done, that money has got a lot of purposes. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is take this to the post office, put it in my bank, and I will join you in literally one second where we stuff this digitally. Hi, bestie, just got back from the post office, having a bit of an errand day today. So yeah, that's what's happening. Sorry I look a mess, but uh, we'll get back to studio situations in a sec. Okay, so we're in my Monzo account now. You can see that I've got 575 and it's time to distribute all of that money. So let's go ahead and do that. So first of all, we've got the water bill here. We're gonna add the 25 pounds that I took out which should make it 125 and correct, lovely. Next we have clothing, which I did have. So we're gonna add 50 pounds into there. It's all looking good so far. Add a 50 pound into clothing, lovely. So this is what it looks like now. The emergency fund is at a thousand. And then I assume that every time I top it up and it gets to more than a thousand, I'm gonna transfer that thousand into my premium bonds. So we've got Simon and Gracie 150 and four and a half K 350, which should be 500 pounds. That's what I should have left. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add money and yeah i've got 500 pounds left so i'm going to put that in and then when i top it up to more than 500 pounds that's when i will do it so yeah and when i say do it i mean move it into my premium bonds account so this is the state of affairs so carmen has a 100 water has 125 going to spend that really soon tattoo has 300 referral bonuses which is when you download the monzo app and get an account just like what i've got here uh, the link is in the description you get a five and so do i so i've cashed out 100 pound twice on that so we're at 45 at the moment i've got 600 pound for holiday i've got 300 pound for month ahead clothing is at 150 Mary Cashmas is 100 and emergency fund is 1,500 but 500 of that is going over so looking really really good okay so that is the digital cash I think let's go ahead and talk to the most stunning man you've ever seen like seriously pay that guy a compliment he's beautiful hi guys guys and on bypass thank you so much for getting through to the end of the video you know I love it when you get through to the end of the video please give this video some love make sure you like comment share and subscribe and if you are going to comment please use this emoji are you a cash stuffer? Because if you are, how often do you do this? I like to do it once a month, just as a sort of yardstick of how well I'm doing. Now, sometimes the money will seriously roll over. Like next time we do a consolidation, because so many of those envelopes were at 90, 95, 85, we're gonna be taking out a lot less next month. So it was nice to do a smaller one, but like, as I said, that money has got plenty of places to go. And I'm really excited to A, buy those shoes, feel comfort from knowing that Simon and Gracie are covered should anything happen. Um, yeah, I feel really, really good about it. Let me know down in the comments down below how often you do this. Have you considered becoming a channel member or a patron? Patrons get exclusive content sneak peeks and significant discounts off my Etsy store. Channel members get early access to every single video. In fact, they've seen this video long before you have, Bestie. If you like the sound of those perks and you like the sound of me, have a look at the link in the description. You will not regret it, Bestie. That's all we have for this month's consolidation. But until next month's consolidation, I would like you to have a wonderful day, wonderful week, and have a wonderful budget. Always remember, don't trust Ira. And Bestie, I'm going to leave you with a cash stuffing playlist over here. This is the playlist that I did to get into the situation I am now. So all of these weeks and weeks of cash stuffing gets me to this place where I can take this money out and go to the bank. So it's a wonderful thing to do. And if you have missed any of the videos, definitely check them out over here.